What's good, Meat Boys? Real quick, shout out to our latest subs, Brandon Pile, Kyle Edis. Appreciate you girl and showing with the boys. If you're new here, he's me on boy. Girl that subscribe button, boys, because uh, we got another absolute banger coming for you right here. It's a solid scrap. We got Khabib's cousin, Abu Bakar and Ramaga Medov taking on the hard hitting Jared Gooden, aka Night Train. Both these guys lost their debuts. Gooden to Alan Joe Ban, uh, Abu Bakar to David Zawada. Uh, so a solid rebound opportunity for those both these guys as they're trying to get their first UFC W. Uh, Abu Bakar is a former combat Sambo champion, has an impressive 15 3 and 1 record overall, but the last few years of his career have been kind of unceremonious. I mean, he started strong in the PFL tournament, but then had to pull out ultimately with that hand injury. Um, and then he makes his debut and succumbs to a triangle choke to uh, David Zawada, uh, who does have a nasty ground game. And we know Abu Bakar is trying to get the fight there. So uh, it was just kind of uh, an underwhelming uh, debut for Nurmagomedov, though. We know what he's going to try to do. As mentioned, he's going to try and go in there, take you down. And we know that uh, Night Train Gooden is going to be throwing meat bombs, looking to just turn the lights off of Abu Bakar. Uh, Night Train Gooden is 17-5 and five overall, just 27 years old. And uh, we mentioned he, he lost his debut to Alan Joban, but there's no shame. I mean, Joban is a tough, refined veteran, plenty of UFC wins. So uh, as mentioned, it's just a great opportunity for both these guys. So do you think Night Train is going to get it done, or are you going with the Shuvak, Abu Bakar, and Nurmagomedov in this one? Yeah, this is a good fight. Um you know, it's it's pretty interesting because, uh, I mean, Night Train was on a three-fight win streak. Got his first loss in UFC debut. Um, but, you know, so did, uh, you know, Khabib's cousin. So it's pretty interesting to see 78% or that bullish on, and I think it's just the last name. I'm going to be honest. But I, I think he's going to get it done. I think Night Train is a little bit of a Night Train bum. Um, and I, I just think... Uh, Khabib's cousin, you know, has been training and knows the discipline. I think Khabib's going to get him in shape. You know, he's holding that that, that name. You know, he, he's got to keep the reputation as a smasher. So uh, that's why I'm going to go with him and uh, be there with the tapology people. I think it will be decision. I don't see a knockout happening. But if anyone is getting knocked out, it is going to be Khabib's cousin. Uh, but I just don't think he's going to uh, get knocked out. I think he's going to win by decision. Yeah, I feel that. I mean, it's it's got to be tough to to represent a last name like Nurmagomedov, right? And uh, n no disrespect to Abu Bakar, the guy can obviously smash you, as you said. But of the Nurmagomedov uh, lineage, he's you know he's probably the lowest on the totem pole. So it, it's going to be interesting to see what he can do against the Night Train in this one. Um, I do think there's something to that, though. I mean, the fact that Abu Bakar is a minus two forty favorite, uh, despite his recent m most recent appearances. And uh, the fact they just lost via, you know, submission in his debut, uh, I think that the last name is really playing into the odds in this one um, because Jared Gooden or uh, Jared Gooden's pretty tough. I mean, he, he can hit, hit you hard. He's got some finishes on his record and uh, he, he's a lot younger than Abu Bakar, too. So uh, I'm with you. Uh, I'm going to go with Nurmagomedov, but this is one that I would stay away from. I think that minus 240 tag is just a little too expensive. Um, but I'm with you. I think Nurmagomedov is going to find a way to get this done. Uh, I'm going by decision, and Tapology uh, looks like most is going with Abu Bakar, 78%. They say decision as well. Do you think that's uh, uh, Abu Bakar's path, decision? Yeah, I think that's a fair assessment. I think he's going to get it done by decision. Um, I really don't see anything fancy or um, sh flashy uh, for a, a special win by him. Uh, it's just going to be, you know, uh, a, a slow, slow sizzle decision win. Um, it might even be a split. This could be a close fight, to be honest. But uh, I, th I think he's still going to get the job done. I'm with you. It's a slow sizzle to sizzle. I'm going with Nurmagomedov. So we're both going with Abu Bakar in this one. Check out the other vids, me boys.